Well, I got, I got started uh, about four years ago when my dad, my dad's been playing guitar for a large portion of his life. One day I just told him, hey dad, you know, I want to learn how to play guitar because I've always grown up around music. Music's a huge part of my family and uh, he inspired me to start learning and ever since I picked up that guitar the first day, I, you know, I absolutely fell in love with it. I'm out on my own, I ain't got no home, somewhere alone, chill to the bone. People say, you know, to me after I play a set, they're like, hey, you know, keep going with this. And I'm like, I can't get out of it. I'm already, I'm already for, so far involved with it. Blues is just, it's just showing the inside of your soul. You know, you're, you're putting it all out there. And I just love the tasteful guitar licks and the vocal runs and everything. It's just, it's, it's me, it's, it's me on the inside. And it sort of helped me break out, um, helped me um, open up to other people. And, you know, basically learn how to interact getting into performing in front of other people. I was more of a introverted and shy kind of person, but ever since I started performing, it's helped me become more open to other people, you know. Before I do anything, my mom always says, hey, you gotta make sure your grades are up. Because if my grades aren't up, I'm not gonna be able to do any things I do. And um, we'll automatically take a break from it, and I have to cancel any gigs I'm doing, and I have to do my work. And uh, I, so I always try to keep my work and my grades up so that I can do things like this. It's a, it's a motivation, sort of, sort of dangling over my head, you know, motivating me to, do, to work hard in school, get good grades, be respectful to my teachers. She got a voice like honey, and two eyes like gold. She's got enough soul for soul that ain't at all. She's got blues, she's meant to free. But I don't want no love, and the woman ain't loving me. The International Blues Challenge was this uh, congregation of thousands of blues musicians from around the world, um, hosted by the Blues uh, Foundation in Memphis, Tennessee, which is the epicenter of blues. And uh, my band is called Mo Pie. It's a six-person six uh, blues band. And uh, we basically were formed together by the Kentucky Blues Society to compete. We got a great reception from the people there. Um, people actually told us that we needed to next year compete in the adult competitions because they thought we were just as good or even better than some of the adults that competed, which is an extremely nice thing for them to say, and uh, it really meant a lot. I don't want no love, don't want no love, don't want no love, let the woman ain't loving me, yeah. You, you work hard at something, not just, you know, get it done. You have to make sure that you put your best foot forward, and that's sort of what I learned with competing in the Blues Challenge, but it was, it was a great experience. 